Well, I'm up here day two up at this Carnelian Agate dig site doing um, some more restoration work and walking around and feeling pretty frustrated. I guess that's the right word. Let me take, you, take a break and show you what I came across here and then we'll have a conversation about some of this stuff. Okay. Now I know this is almost like a typical public grounds dig site. I know that there are areas that's worse than this such as Hanson Creek, Crane Creek, um, Whistler Springs, White Fir, uh, Glass Butte, Davis Creek, just to name a few. But this is what we walked up on. People not caring about where they're digging, not bothering to fill in their holes back, leaving material scattered all over the place. The big pet peeve of the end of this um, Kate, the coordinator for this activity, is those digging under live trees. Makes sense. I can appreciate that. So that's what we did. As with the prior video, you saw where the Mrs. Jaws Jr. took a an area, and we filled in pretty well around the base of a live tree. Then we continued on doing our own stuff. I had to come up here today, walk around. I wanted to pick up some of the surface finds up here. There's a lot of jasper laying up here on the ground. I did find one carnelian agate too. Not very big, but it is one. See, here's a piece of jasper right here. I'll go in the bucket. I'll take that home with me. But I wanted to show you guys this. So now that you saw more of what's going on up here, maybe some of you can understand the frustration that the coordinator, Kate, has on how things are tore up and there's a pretty good chance that the uh, Forest Service could shut this down to digging. We had a Forest Service representative up here yesterday and he was talking to us and he was pleased to see that there's people up here actually taking care of it and wanting to correct some of the problems. Can't correct it all. Some of this stuff up here, above, here behind me, down here at my feet, whatever. See another, basically another live tree. The roots are being dug out on. Um, not everything can be corrected. But if some of the people that come up here take a little bit of time to fill in these types of areas with some of the overburden and the stuff that material I was already taken out of it, this place could make a much nicer appearing dig site and reduce the risk of it being shut down. It's an individual decision. I'm not telling you that you have to do it or you're an idiot if you don't. It's an individual decision. I made the decision to come up here to help out and I'm being rewarded by being able to take some material home. Which is fine. I'm going to really look forward to it. And it's mostly Jasper. That's fine with me. A few Carnelian agate pieces, but not that much. But I'm really happy with what we're taking home. So that's kind of a, a sign of my appreciation. I give up some time, come up here to do some of the restoration work. And then... I'm rewarded by being able to take some of the material home that I find out of the pile that I put back in there, as well as doing some walking around and finding some other stuff. So, it's a win-win for me, in my eyes. And I'm not saying that you have to go do this. Just something that, consider. What we're going to do is, I'm going to take the material I've collected from up here down to the rig, we're going to go track down the Mrs. Jaws Jr. She decided she wanted to do a whole new dig location 
at the base of a burnt out stump, which is just fine. It's not a live tree. So uh, I'm going to go up there and see how she's doing, give her a hand, and then the rest of the group will be here this afternoon, and I will check back in with you then as well, and we'll see what everybody else is doing. Well, we are at the dig site. We're here prior to the rest of the group. We have a couple of stragglers that were here from yesterday. And they're over here laughing at me, but that's fine. you got to understand that we got a very interesting group of people here with this, doing this rock counting stuff. But here's two of the more interesting characters right here. I think I just got insulted, but I'm not yeah. sure. <laughs> as long as you did too, Tommy, I'm good with that. Yeah, well. Just take it as you see I'm, fit. I'm, a, I'm abused all the time, so that's fine. I don't want you to feel unloved. Oh, I'm not. Good. Don't worry. <laughs> I don't feel that way. So, over here being ambitious with the small pick and getting down to the next layer, hopefully to find that elusive carnelian agate. Yeah, it's not carnelian, but it's, uh, well, this one might be. It's got a nice pocket mark in it. It could be. This is like that one that we that you lit up for me last night. Yes, that's right. So I'm gonna throw it in my bucket. I don't know if it's anything, but it's going in the bucket. If not, it'll be part of the driveway later on. That's exactly right. Backfill. Yeah. <laughs> Backfill. Yeah. <laughs> so now I got to go down to my hole, but I can't walk you guys down there because Mrs. Jaws Jr. is head deep in it, and you know how she feels about being on camera. So I'll have to do this tactfully. <laughs> She'll probably go run and run down the hill and hide from me. But I'll show you what we found over there at our down at our little hole we're digging at. Probably yeah. Okay, we're over here now and here is the hole that I was working in. I still am. And what we're doing is, we're, yes, that's Mrs. Jaws Jr. foot right there. You can't see her, but that's her foot. You wiggle your foot so we know it's you. See? There she is. There's her foot. And we're digging out of the hole, spreading it out here, going through it, and then we're going to push it off into that hole down there. So uh, let me show you one of the things that we just found. Isn't that a beauty? Now that Mrs. Charles Jr. is hinting at that she's found something else for me to look at. So, I'll do the swap off with her as she's doing this digging. Where's that one? And there it is before any dirt's removed. So let's walk over here. And this clay is sticky, but there, look at the color on that. There you go. Not too bad. So I'll check in with you guys in a bit. Okay, everybody, we got something here, something here to show you guys. With the assistance of the lovely Mrs. Jog Jr. piece of bacon. Yeah. That's the piece of bacon there. I like that one. This one has got it in there on both sides. Very nice. Very nice. Now, Steve up here has got a big one. And we've got to convince him to show it to us. Please don't. We can't unsee that. 
<laughs> well, there's Mrs. Jaws Jr. and her lovely attitude about it. <laughs> that have brought the fresh air. Jeez, I don't know if I can handle such negativity. <laughs> so, they're up here digging some more chunk of jasper. But yeah, look at this thing. Oh, that is something. That is pretty. Holy cow. Be pretty yeah. nice when it's cleaned up, hopefully. Just, just a little jealous on this one. Uh -huh. There's another one here with the carnelian band in here covered in clay, so you really can't see it very well yet. And one more pretty deep red carnelian. Beautiful. I'm a very happy camper. My biggest I've ever found. Very good. All three of them are. And he's got some typical small stuff and some jasper he's hanging on to. Yeah. So, so we've got we've got some mules working here. I'm telling you, let's walk up here to this other pit. Describe the fire smell, I think. I think so. Uh, no, hard working, hard working. Oh yeah, here's a little banded pup we just pulled. just just pulled out. Just pulled out of that. Put it in the sunshine. There you yeah, go. Yeah, banded little pupper. She's dirty though. That's fine. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's something special. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, we pulled some good reds out of here. So. And we moved that log to do it. <laughs> do what you got to do. All right. See, look at him at it. I hate to throw these away because I don't know what happens when you have these younger folk out here doing stuff. They could actually be ambitious. Don't worry, I'll be dead tonight. Oh, you might have a couple glasses of wine to drink first. Oh, yeah. Nice little Jasper chunker. Yep. It's got some nice marks on it. Oh, yeah. See, that's a keeper in my world. Look at that big one over here. There's your gift. <laughs> okay. It's, it's going to make good use of it. We think that big chunk right there is Jasper. Oh, the one on top of the pile down there? Yeah. Okay. We'll take a look at it. Because everybody here watching us, watching me, knows that I like Jasper. Oh, yeah. And they've seen earlier uh, some of the stuff that we've picked up, so. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is a good spot. Yep. Well, everybody will check in here real soon. Maybe somebody else will find another one that we're all jealous of. But, you know, these two here are going to be leaving real soon, so we. <laughs> yeah, somebody, they'll be leaving here real soon, and uh, we won't have to worry about. See, oh, geez, another one. <laughs> yep. It's his day for this stuff. Uh -huh. Everybody's entitled to their day. Yeah. I'm pretty happy camping. He doesn't usually find big stuff like no. that. It's usually me that gets the lucky one that I got, but he's done it this weekend. Too. All so now we are back at it. Let's see what else we can find. Yes, the Mrs. Josh Jr. wants one of those big ones that Steve had. <laughs> She really does. But you know, we're not skunked. We've have, we're having fun, and we're finding some beauties. Even though they're small, we're still finding some beauties. Well, everybody, I'm back. We have had a change of the guard here. We've had, and... And see, this is one of the best sounds you want to hear at a rock counting oh, spot, yeah. is people laughing. Best ever. <laughs> best ever. True. Best time ever, ever having. Oh, yeah. So, are we having fun today? Yes, we are. Best time ever. Oh, so pretty. Let's get a shot of that. Oh, yeah. Show them. Look at that, honey. Okay. Get her wet. Just beautiful. Carnelian County. That's why we come here. Some of the most beautiful stuff out here. Yes. Being around great people, great material we're finding, and it's not 100 degrees. All good. All good. Okay. Let's wander over here to see what else has been found. You have a rock. We have a rock. <laughs> oh. 
So, what do we got over here? Well, we got a couple of nice red pupsters. Oh yeah, some carnelians, some galaxies, some sweet bands. Oh yeah. Very nice. Oh yeah. Very nice. This one, I can't wait to shine a light through her. Okay. <laughs> So, a little bit smaller crowd than yesterday, but you know, the ones who are not here that were here yesterday are missing out today. Absolutely. That's right. <laughs> okay, so we're back. Here's a little bit of an education for everybody from Kate. Um, well, Cornelian, Cornelian is a Greek word for flesh because it glows like your flesh does when you hit it with a light, like your fingers, ears, ears. So basically when you put a flashlight underneath your, your fingers, do you see the light will actually come through it? The same thing with the carnelian agate. Yeah. after a long day of digging and hauling and having a good old time. So this over here is from yesterday. This over here is just part of today. Let me show you what we got for today. Just some of it, not all of it. And here's just some of it and mildly cleaned up. But I'm sure that you guys will want to look at this one here. Some agate, lots of jasper. That side there is wet, so you can see in the winter. It almost reminds me of a plume agate.
So, as you can tell, I've been dizzy digging in the dirt. Now here's a chunk of uh, Jasper. I don't know if the camera's picking that up or not. It should pick up that. There's a little bit of Jersey right there. Very fine. It's very smooth, but still got some sparkle to it. going to do is sometime this winter we will do a closer look at the Carnelian County weekend the finds from it which will include all of that and more and so I'll pull out some of the nicer ones sometime this winter when it's nasty and rainy and everything else and none of us are out rock County then I will show you here online what we've got in more detail. Okay, everybody, this two-day adventure to Carnelian County is a wrap. We had a wonderful time fixing other people's messes and going after some real beauties on our own. So for now, just remember, Everyone's life is an adventure. Then there's mine! This is the Adventures of Josh Jr. Have a good one, everybody. See ya!